Howdy y'all and welcome back to my channel. We are going to be doing Minecraft today and we are going to do a couple of redstone machines specifically made to slaughter your friends. So that sounds a bit messed up, but we're going to start off small. Do you want something rapid fire? Do you want something just to the capability to burn down someone's house or the capability to just completely make a mess? Well, this machine here is going to help you with that, if you're that kind of person, with your friends at least. Alright, so, this will be a machine gun sort of theme. And, just for a bit of design, you might want some fences or something. You only need one, but, alright, um... Alright, so after you do all that, you're going to just start placing it all right after you get a few more stuff. Um, dispensers and fire charges. You just place the fence here, and then you place the dispenser in any which direction you want it to shoot in. I am not going to fire it up yet because it'll go rapid fire once I go put the observers correctly. So this is going to create a redstone clock because these observers see each other and they're going to constantly make a redstone pulse. It would actually be smarter to put the piston over here. My bad. All right. So that there. Then a block of your choice. Something that'll look army-like, like here. And then you put the observer going this way. After that, you put another observer up here going the opposite direction. The reason for this is because once these two observers look at each other, this thing is going to spew fire charges or whatever you're using everywhere. So, careful with that. Then, it just rapid fires forever. And it doesn't make that annoying clicking sound, too. Alright, on to my next one. What if you didn't want to just use a machine gun? What if you wanted to drive in the night, or in general, and you could just shoot arrows while you're doing that? Well, let me introduce you to a tank. You probably know what a tank is, but... I'm going to show you how to make a redstone tank, which is easy, actually. So, um, yeah, this isn't too complicated at all. So all you need is just the stuff below. Obviously, dispensers and observers, pistons to help it move. I will explain the tank once I build it. Do not worry about a thing. And to start it up, you will need a redstone block. And also, two fire charges. Because we're going to add two dispensers. Alright. If I forgot something, then I'll go back for it. Alright, so put the treads here. This is important. If the observers are facing this way, then the tank is going to go this way. So, if you get stuck on that, then you can just think of that. Alright, so... Let me just put these here. Oh, wait, I forgot something. In case you wanted it to light up. Alright, so... Here are the basic stuff here. That you'll need. And you can use glowstone or a shroom light, but I prefer a shroom light because they're brighter at night. All right, so here's how it'll work. When I put a redstone block right here, it'll activate this piston pushing it forward along with these dispensers. These dispensers will detect that it moved forward, so it'll push these sticky pistons back and pull them back up because it only makes a flash. Also, along with these, it'll be powering with a redstone block, 
activating both of these dispensers at the same time, making two machine guns. So, this is how it works. So, you can also just ride it right here. And it's fireproof, so the fire on it should go out really quickly. I do not recommend you sneak while you're on it because that will not turn out too well for you. But this is your basic idea, and it spews fireballs everywhere, so careful of lag. What if you didn't want a tank, though? What if you wanted it in the air? What if you wanted to drop bombs on a base while shooting fireballs at the same time? I do not recommend these for new people who will not get a thing, but I will explain it. Don't worry. What if you wanted a bomber plane? So, I'm going to start showing y'all how to make a bomber plane now. So, this will probably be a bit easier if I can just remember. No, I remember perfectly. It's just I'm um, not thinking as straight as I should be. But anyway, what the hey. So, these are your basic ones. Now I just need this to start it. I will need TNT and two stacks of fire charges. I will need one more thing. I think I forgot it. I'm not sure. But we'll go back for it. This is a really fun thing to play with, but this is the lag. This one will make you lag really easily, so be careful. This also causes a mass amount of destruction. You can obviously add more stacks of TNT. I just don't recommend it. For But for the sake of the video, actually, we're not going to add more. So, this is everything here. For the basic design... You're probably just going to do this as the tail wings. You're going to put these observers facing this way with two pistons facing out. You also want these here so that it will attach with everything else too. I will explain this. Do not worry if you do not get a thing I'm doing. Just follow along. Hopefully you can, and I will explain it. I will eventually do a redstone tutorial on how everything works, but right now, I'm just showing y'all how to do this bomber plane. Alright, so, that's a that. And... You'll put these observers here, and you'll also put one dis observer right here with one dispenser. So those two are loaded, now let's load this one with TNT. This makes a mess, trust me. I think I got everything on this plane. So here's how it works. Once I set off this flare, it will... D this these both observers will detect it, which means this will drop a bomb and this one will start flying. This one observer will detect a signal to this slime. These observers will get the energy and start shooting. These observers are also getting signals after this piston from this slime block pulls this back end. Then these observers know they're getting moved, so they push it back. They, and then these observers know that they're getting moved, so they shoot more. And this one, and this one keep doing their thing. And it repeats. This is a really complicated one, so it's okay if you didn't completely get it. I will give you all a second to look at it again. Take as much screenshots as you like. Alright. Alright, I think y'all could have gotten them by now. So, let's start it up. This thing will kill everything in sight. And you can even ride this thing. 
Sneaking not recommended once again. But you could have someone like here in the cockpit. Just don't go in the middle or else you drop with the rest of the bombs. If the bombs don't kill you, the fall damage will. But yes, this is crazy. And it only depends on one engine. All right, so that is that. Thank y'all for watching. If y'all want more redstone, then comment down below so I actually know. And if you want me to do Minecraft with my friend, then let's get to 50 subscribers. Because we are planning on doing a Lucky Block Survival Series. But I'm not going to spoil too much. So y'all help me get to 50 subscribers, please. And I will give y'all a Minecraft Lucky Block Survival Series. Thank you. And bye-bye.